Hello again, dear viewers. It's the day number nine of my Miracle Morning Challenge, together with my wife, of course. And uh, I'm starting to see the difference in my life with this uh, Miracle Morning stuff. Now, we both agree to the fact that this has totally changed us in a way that now we both feel more positive we get much more things done uh, during the day and feels like now I won't go into the extreme of saying that we have found purpose for our lives it's not that it's just that the mornings are getting easier and easier uh, and I don't mean like waking up early or something like that I, I, I just mean that when we're starting to go to work it feels like we have a purpose it feels like we're in a flow state everything is moving onwards and uh, if we do have some setbacks during the day everything seems to be easier to cope with to handle the difficulties uh, during the day but on the same token we both agreed uh, today when we were discussing that it seems like everything is moving to the direction that we want it's it's not as much of a struggle anymore uh, then some good things happening I'm starting to lose weight not not in a huge amount of weight but I I had I lost in one week I lost uh, uh, 0 0.5 kilos which is recommended by the experts as far as I know now I'm not an expert in this but they say that the healthy amount of weight to lose is 0 0.5 kilos per week which means two kilos in month now whether that's true or not, I'm not commenting on that one. Uh, you may decide for yourself it's, if it's good or not. I would have liked it to be bigger, the weight loss. However, we did have our anniversary day on Friday and the effects from that are definitely staying on my body. Uh, but yeah, as as we were discussing with my wife about this Miracle Morning stuff, she also agreed that uh, everything is starting to change. Like, um, uh, I told you already that we get much more done, but the amount of things we get done in one day, it's amazing. I mean, uh, <laughs> before we even get to the work, we have done uh, maybe wash, washed laundry, done some other things, done all home chores already, already uh, made some uh, big things during the morning and so on. Now the funny thing is now for me uh, two weeks ago I basically went to to work straight from bed just get up wash, wash my face do the basic stuff brush the teeth uh, put on the clothes and go to the work. Now I'm, I'm waking up at 6 o'clock in the morning and I have difficulties to come to my workplace before 9 and I'm, I'm like amazed that how did we get anything done since now I'm starting to feel that I should wake up at 5 o'clock in the morning just to have the time to do these things and everything seems so much easier to do during the morning when you have all the energy you have all the enthusiasm you have all those things uh, working for you it, it feels like uh, everything happens so effortless uh, it's so effortless to do those things so uh, definitely something I recommend to everyone please try the miracle morning it really works um, now today as I was going on with the things to do in the morning I started to realize that still 
my main goal during the mornings is to wake up actually to wake up not to stay in bed haven't done that except on the Saturday when we decided to sleep in we we woke up a bit later but other than that I have risen up from bed every morning and taking the glass of water and going for the walk now that has been my main focus so far during during this exercise basically now uh, I have done the silence of which I spoke yesterday but I'm starting to realize that I'm still not putting enough effort into that one because the silence part is it's hard it's difficult to do especially if you if you don't uh, if you haven't done it before it, it, it feels difficult and then in the life savers the s was for silent silence uh, a is for affirmation so you should basically affirm yourself tell positive things about you give give a boost to your self-confidence and everything like that now i'm not entirely sure if this is a thing for the finnish people or something like that but uh, giving a compliment for yourself basically affirming yourself seems a bit challenging uh, because you're basically saying to yourself that you're a good person you're you're doing good you're you're this kind of person and you're you're gonna achieve this by doing this being this person you're gonna achieve things and blah 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 it sounds like you're bragging about yourself now even if you're telling that for yourself it feels difficult now I do understand that the point of the the whole thing is to affirm yourself tell yourself that you're good you can do it you can blah 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 when you do that enough long time you will start to believe in it you will start to act like it and then you will get the things from it now I do understand that part but I uh, it was something that was more difficult than I expected now also of course I will do these things I will put more effort into them starting from tomorrow uh, I will start writing them down and affirming myself uh, but that's also one thing that was harder than I expected also the other lifesavers also except for the exercise have been something and reading exercise and reading that will be easy but uh, or well in my case reading listening I do the audiobook versions but I was planning that maybe I should start reading actually read old-fashioned book read and to make some notes from that one uh, so maybe I will start reading tomorrow excuse me um, it's quite silent here everyone else is asleep I'm still editing uh, the videos that will be posted tomorrow morning into the web so I just have to wait them for them to be exported and I can start rendering them into the right format well anyhow so basically I will start tomorrow morning to concentrate more on the other lifesavers part silence and the affirmations at first also reading I will concentrate more tomorrow and actually do it in the manner that is recommended in the Miracle Morning book uh, I know that maybe I shouldn't take it so seriously or something like that but the benefits only from the rising up rising up and exercising it has been so huge and I do have done I have done the silence part also but I want to put more effort to that one to actually do it in the proper way and maybe I will start reaping better benefits from that one also but yeah nine days behind tomorrow is the infamous day number 10 which ends the first 10 day period which which is the hardest one according to the book as as far as I understood it now if we get over to the 
from 10 to 20 it will get easier and easier and then the last 10 days should be easier now today my wife expressed her wish that this is something that we will continue and we're definitely never going back we still have the memory from last saturday how foggy everything seemed how how disconnected everything seemed we we couldn't really grasp anything and according to my wife also last saturday was the only day from the last week when you didn't want to do things you just wanted to sit on the sofa take it easy and so on uh, we actually discussed that when have we last time watched netflix usually it was like a daily almost a chore to do watch some series or something like that we actually started watching marco polo season two uh before we started this one but after we started this one we haven't seen one single episode of marco polo and i'm not actually even missing it that much Okay, maybe in the coming Saturday we will sit down in the evening when the kids are asleep, watch one movie, maybe two episodes of uh, series, either or, not both, uh, and then go back to sleep because it, it feels like that this is something that we're going to implement into our life indefinitely. And uh, that of course brings us to the challenge of having dinner parties and so on we like to do the barbecue uh, with with our friends now of course we can start start it earlier so that we get to the end a bit sooner so that we get to the bed about 10 o'clock or something like that but that will be a huge change for our friends and for us because usually our uh, barbecue parties have lasted into the early hours uh, basically 2 3 a.m. is not uncommon but now we just have to start a bit earlier end it a bit earlier so that we will have our good night's sleep um, yeah <sighs> now I'm getting sorry now I'm getting really tired uh, one note noteworthy thing though is that I have my uh, activity bracelet what you call it jawbone and according to this one the amount of deep sleep that I get during the night has gone down significantly uh, previously I was getting like one hour one and a half hour easily every day in the deep sleep mode uh, however nowadays I'm getting like from 5 to 35 minutes of deep sleep maybe it's a change in my uh, s something that causes this I'm not really sure but something has changed definitely Ooh. sorry once again as you can see I'm starting to get too tired so let's end this vlog right here right now see you guys tomorrow thanks bye